Hey there, let's talk about Gemini 3 Pro and a new agentic development platform called Anti-Gravity. There's really no other way to say it. The benchmarks for Gemini 3 Pro are incredible. The jump in performance was dramatic, much more than most people expected. Gemini 3 Pro demonstrates state-of-the-art reasoning, coding, and multimodal understanding, topping the LM Arena leaderboard and achieving high scores on humanity's last exam. It excels in mathematics and multimodal reasoning, achieving state-of-the-art results on Math Arena Apex, MU Pro, and Video MMU, showcasing PhD-level capabilities. Alongside this, a new agentic development platform named Anti-Gravity was also launched, designed to evolve the IDE towards an agent-first future. Essentially, it's a full VS Code fork, which might surprise some, but with Gemini 3 Pro built directly into its core. Anti-Gravity offers an editor view for AI-powered coding and a manager surface for orchestrating multiple autonomous AI agents across different workspaces. These agents can autonomously plan, execute, and verify complex tasks across the editor, terminal, and browser, generating artifacts like markdown files and architecture diagrams. While the developer community will assess its performance against other IDEs like Cursor, Anti-Gravity's advantages are clear. It's coupled with Gemini 3 Pro's state-of-the-art capabilities, Gemini 2.5 computer use, and Nano Banana for rich media generation, handling over 1 million tokens. This allows anti-gravity to understand entire monorepos without truncation and execute real-time API testing directly within the IDE. Anti-gravity's agent-first approach positions it as a task delegator for developers, a significant leap forward in AI-assisted software development. A lot to unpack today. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more concepts and quick explainers like this one.